At the end of your life, you will groan when your flesh and body are spent. You will say, how I hated discipline, how my heart spurned correction. I would not obey my teachers or turn my ear to my instructors, and I was soon in serious trouble in the assembly of God's people. Flee from sexual immorality. All other sins a person commits are outside the body, but whoever sins sexually sins against their own body. Do you not know that your bodies are temples of the Holy Spirit who is in you, whom you have received from God? You are not your own. You were bought at a price. Therefore, honor God with your bodies. No temptation has overtaken you except what is common to mankind. And God is faithful. He will not let you be tempted beyond what you can bear. But when you are tempted, he will also provide a way out so that you can endure it. Hello everyone, this is going to be short and simple because the answer on how to fight lust is short and simple. Now because something is short and simple does not mean it's easy. The only way to fight lust, my friends, is to flee from it. You must flee from sexual immorality. Jesus has also told his disciples multiple times, pray that you will not fall into temptation. He said, why are you sleeping? He asked them, get up and pray so that you will not fall into temptation. Pray for the strength to fight it. Pray for it, my friends. But also what you need to do is you need to recognize temptation itself. Recognize that you are being tempted. Recognize it. Because when you can recognize it, that's when you can fight it. That's when you can flee from it. Lust is all over the place. If you're scrolling, the best thing I could say to do is when you see it, by the time you see it, you've probably been scrolling enough. Get off of it. Close the app. Close your phone. Take your mind off it. Do something else. Recognize that it is tempting you. When you can recognize the temptation or any other sin that you fall to, when you can recognize it before it happens, is how you prevent it. Because you know that if you do fall to lust, if you do beat your meat, if you do that, you know after you do it, you're gonna feel like such a worthless human being. And you were created by the Lord, you are nowhere near worthless, nowhere near it. So don't fall to lust. Do not let the temptation overcome you. Flee from it.